Hello and welcome back to my second day of playing Kirby's Adventure. It's really early right now and I don't know how much time I have so I'm actually gonna jump right in. It's nice to see that the game saved by itself but I'm still gonna use the, the saving spots uh, provided by the Nintendo Switch just in case I come back one day and there's nothing left. So if you ever wonder why the screen like flickers, sometimes it's just because I save and I I crop it out. I'll be starting with the crane again because why not? It's up. Um, let's stock up on some lives. So let's try to get the two big ones this time. No catching him under the arms. Oh no. Oh! You see this time he didn't fall. So that's great, that's already one. And the other one is a little bit closer. Can I get two? Perfect, he's not going anywhere. Nice, this is a great start. Let's hope everything goes as smoothly as this. So to be able to play a little longer today, I decided to play first thing in the morning. So it's actually 5.30 a.m. right now. I hope this is going to be a good idea. Hello again. Editing Percy here. It was a bad idea. So before moving on to door 3, there's actually someone in the comments that mentioned that there was a secret door in level 2. So I'm gonna do that again to check it out. I don't know what surprised me the most between the fact that there is a secret door in level 2 or that someone took the time to mention it to me in the comments. Thank you very much. So it should be somewhere over here. I'm assuming it's a completely invisible one because I don't see any anything that will let you think that there's a door. So I'm just trying to press up on the d-pad everywhere Whoops, to see if something actually works, but I have no idea where it is. Maybe in the middle here? Nope. Um, let's see, where else? Here? No. Um, oh! Oh, here it is. I didn't remember this at all. I guess I never found that. Um, can you actually go down here? I'm I'm too scared to try. I don't want to die like this. So, let's set out of here and let's try to get a little bit higher than floor. What was it? 4 last time. I'm having such a hard time with doors. And uh, oh, that you see that that's progress. I'll take it. The thing that confused me is I thought that um the flag changed if you didn't find everything, but I guess that since it was only a uh, one up, maybe it didn't count. But, you know, feel free to tell me if I skip something or anything like that. I really appreciate every comment I get. So, level 3 now. I don't remember how many levels there is per... Um, like, how many little doors there is per level. But I think it's 5. It's really odd because in the story it's it was talking about seven monsters and um well seven friends that uh, DDD had and I just I can't remember this game being that long. I am just getting hit by absolutely everything. That's what happens when I play this early. Like it's like if my brain just can't catch up and this is not even a, a hard game I mean it's not like ghosts and goblins this I shouldn't get hit that much 
Ghosts and Goblins is a game that I really want to revisit later on, but yeah, when you only have two two chances, two hits, and then it's over, I'm gonna have to sharpen my skills. I'll just have a quick look everywhere. <laughs> now I'm just paranoid about missing doors. Hmm, nothing. I'm still getting used to the- <laughs> This is pathetic. Um, I'm still getting used to the controls. Um, I've been playing... Seriously? <laughs> This is so embarrassing. Anyways, I was saying, um, I've been playing a lot of, um, the last Kirby that came out. Kirby's, um, what is it again? Kirby and the Forgotten Land. And in that game, you actually press B to fly. Oh my god, I didn't expect him to go that fast. Huh. Okay, let's start over. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, you press B to fly, it's actually, it's, you double jump and you fly. So this is the hardest thing I find right now, is that when I want to fly, I actually try to double jump and it doesn't work. But other than that, it's just because it's so early. <laughs> and look at that, tomato right there. <laughs> I mean few pixels away and I would have not died. But hey, I have 8 lives. It's okay. It was bound to happen at some point. I'm not a pro. I'm just here to have fun. And... Level 4. And if I remember correctly, these are the rooms, the showrooms. Where you can get a special power. The museum. A colorful display of enemies with special abilities. Uh, yeah. I want the sword. Let's get the... Oh, okay. That's me needing... I need a coffee. I'm not going in this room without a coffee. I'll be right back. This is really showing how much I'm not a morning person. But hey, it happens. We all have those days where just nothing seems to go right. I think I'll put a counter on the screen for every time I got hit for a dumb reason. Already ahead of you. Actually, not really because I'm in the future. Ugh, it's too early for that. And here we have the ice power. I don't know why I love the sound the ice makes. It's just so satisfying. I'm not even talking anymore, I'm just listening to the ice soundbite. Oh no, my eyes! Oh. oh well, that's that. I don't remember how many powers there is in this game, but... This is impressive. I mean, for for the NES, it, it's really impressive. Well, I know it came out pretty late and they were pushing like how hard um, the NES could go, but it's just, it's just a good game. Just ignore how bad I play it, but it is a good game. 
needles. <gasps> oh, he scared me. It's the power up. Please tell me what you see when you see that power up. Because when I was young, I thought it was a hair dryer. And I'm still not sure what it is. Oh, I'm definitely gonna need this because the way I'm playing, I'm gonna need all the lives I can get. Oh no! Oh, phew, the song was over, but the power was still going. And... Floor 3. I don't remember what's the top floor, but I know it's way higher than that. Oh, and I was right. There is five levels. Let's go get the sword. And this time, let's drop the power outside so we don't swallow it back. I'm not sure if the monsters in the museum can hurt you, but I'm not gonna get close to it to find out. Not with the number of lives I have. So let's go attack um, Wispy Woods, I think is the name of this boss. I'm not sure if he's in every game, but he's in a lot of them. And this is why the sword is important. I don't think you can even get one hit in when you use the sword. It feels like cheating, but they gave us the tools. And we cleared it, little dance. Hey! And with that, we can start level 2. Ice Cream Island. I would say this was a hard one, but it really wasn't. It's just level 1. It's just me. I'm rusty. I haven't played in a long time. And it was still fun. I like it. But yeah, the remotes do help, actually. Um, I find they're, they're smaller than when I was a kid. But I don't know. I would have to compare um, if it's just my hands that got bigger or if they actually made them smaller. But no, I think it's just... I think it's just my perception of them. Thanks for watching, as usual, and thanks for all the comments. Um, it's really fun to see that there's people actually watching. I'm I'm surprised, but I'm I'm happy. See you all next time, and have a great day.